Hey guys, okay, so today we're doing a face of the day um, because I've been doing like get ready with me's for a while and I figured I should do a face of the day because I haven't done one in, I don't know, it's been a while so, and I did make a get ready with me, but it was just like, it was like longer than they usually are and I just didn't really feel like editing it because I've already edited a video today which was a get ready with me for 9-11. But, um, yeah, so I didn't want to do, I didn't want to edit a video like that again. Because those videos take a really long time to edit. Like, a really long time. So, I figured I'd do Face of the Day because it's a lot easier. So, let's just get started. So, and you guys are going to, like, freak out because I'm seriously going to have, like, three videos in one day. Because I uploaded my Get Ready With Me. I'm doing this video. And I'm also going to do probably a Route 21 haul. So, yeah. So, of course, I'm wearing my Clean and Clear Morning Glow Moisturizer. Um... It moisturizes your skin, it brightens skin, and it has SPF 15, so this is really good to put on in the morning just to protect your face for the day. And then, of course, I'm wearing my Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream in medium. I love this stuff. Um, it does all of this good stuff for your skin. You can, like, read that if it would focus. So, yeah, I love this. It gives me a really, like, flawless velvety skin and it just looks really 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 good so i love this product and i recommend it a lot and if you want to try out this product i recommend getting the 17 october issue because it comes with a um green fresh bb cream sample so yeah so this is perfect to try out the product and see if you like it so it comes with this little sample and it also comes with a dollar off coupon and if you end up not liking the product, which I'm sure you will, the coupon is actually for any Maybelline face product, so you don't have to use it for that product. But I'm sure you will like it because it's amazing. So yeah, um, if you want to try this out, I definitely recommend picking up the 17 October issue. And then I have the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Fair Claire under my eyes just because this is really good for under the eyes, and I love it. And then, of course, my Rimmel Stay Matte um, Translucent Pressed Powder. Transparent, sorry. And I feel like I might hit pan soon, but I, I probably won't. I don't know. Yeah. Um, and then I'm wearing the MAC Cream Blush in something special, and I just hauled this, so you should go check out that haul. It's um, of Air Postal Forever 21 in MAC. So, this is the cream blush in something special. And this thing doesn't want to focus, but you can pretty much read that. And this is just a really pretty, um, like, pinky peach color. It's a little bit darker than it's showing up on camera. And more pink. Um, it's getting kind of washed out. It's, like, kind of like that color, but not that dark. I don't know. It's just a really pretty peachy pink color, and I really like this so far. But I feel like it's a little gritty, but it might just be, like, the first layer. I don't know. Or maybe I need to buy, like, a another stipple brush to put on blush. And then I have the Elf Shimmer Palette, which I'm just wearing on my cheekbones and my cupid's bow, as always. And I'm wearing the second color, which I can pan on. And that's it for face. And then for eyes, of course, I'm wearing my e.l.f. Eyelid Primer. Actually, I don't know why I said of course. I haven't used this thing in, like, two months um, because I really like um, my Urban Decay one for right now because I, like, have school, which lasts, like, eight hours, and I have gym class, and I have cross country. And um, I don't know if this would last me through cross country. Um, so... I've been using, using my Urban Decay Primer Potion, but this is, like, the only day of the week, Sunday, that I, um, don't have practice, so I'm using it today, because obviously I'm not going to be doing much sweating. I'm going shopping. Um, and then I have the Revlon Cream Eyeshadow Quad in Seashells, and I know I'm doing a lot of hauls this month, I'm just warning you, because I've already done a Kohl's haul, and a haul from Aeropostale, MAC, and from 21, and then I'm doing a haul today from Rue 21, and then I'm going to have a, uh, maybe a birthday haul up, but that's only if I get anything besides money. And then I'll have a Sephora haul up, because I'm going to Sephora for my birthday. 
um, to treat myself to something. And so, yeah. So, seashells, sorry. I'm wearing this gray color. It's just a really nice matte gray, and I actually really like it. So, yeah, I'm going to start using that more often. And I'm wearing my new MAC eyeshadow. And this is an Electra, which is a frost. And this is like a blue-gray color. It's really pretty, though. And it's a frost, which is my second favorite finish. Because my absolute favorite is Velux Pearl, and then frost is like my second favorite. And that's just on my lid. And I really, really, really like this eyeshadow. So, yay. And then... I'm wearing the MAC eyeshadow, again, a frost, and this one is in rice paper, and I'm just wearing this on my brow bone, and it's just a really, like, yellow highlight color, and then I'm wearing CoverGirl Champagne, of course, on my inner corner, I wear this every day, and then e.l.f. Mascara Primer, this is not very exciting, but, you know, um, and then my CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion, Water resistant, everyone in the dog has and talks about this mascara. I know, I'm sorry, but it's amazing and I use it like every single day. So, love that. And then again, every day, Great Lash Brow Gel. This thing is like almost gone. I'm missing that much product. So, yeah. And then for lips, um, I'm obsessed with the MAC. I almost dropped it. Um, Sheen Supreme Lipsticks. They're like the absolute only lip product in the world that I don't have to wear a chapstick with. So, I'm in love with them, and I have two. I just got this one yesterday, and this one is in Fashion City, which is a really pretty, like, peachy pink color. And even though that this is a peach, I feel like it's more of, like, like a, like, fall peach. So, I feel like this will be really pretty for fall. And the other one I have is also, like, a berry watermelon color, so I feel like that one could be really good for fall. So, if I have any, like, monthly favorites for fall... These are probably going to be in them, but yeah, so I'm trying that on my lips. And they're really moisturizing, they're really pigmented, and they're glossy, and they smell really good. So I pretty much can't get better than this. Oh my gosh. They're amazing. And then just to give it a little bit more gloss, I'm wearing the MAC Luster Glass and Love Nectar, which you can see how much I've used of it. Like, that much is missing. See, I have used a lot of this. The, like, name is, like, rubbing off, but... It smells really good, and this is just a really neutral, um, peachy color. And then, um, Boring, and I never mentioned these, but I just decided to, I'm wearing my Elf Makeup Mist and Set in Clear. That's exciting. So, um, yeah, I've been using this, um, pretty much ever since I got it, and I do really like it. I don't know if it makes a huge, significant difference in my makeup, but... I feel like it really does, um, like, now, since I have cross-country, because usually um, my makeup would kind of sweat off, like I said, with the Elf Eyelid Primer and everything. But since I'm using the Urban Decay one and this makeup setting spray, my makeup really um, stays locked in. So that's been great. Um, so, yeah, sorry this video was so long, but thank you for watching, and please subscribe. And sorry for so many hauls this month, but it's my birthday month, so YOLO. Um, so thanks for watching and please subscribe.